Hey guys, it's Monday, March 23rd. It's day 21 of Larch, and I'm just getting the vlog uploading now. It's noon. It's a little later than usual. I did not have my workout stream this morning because I, I was up. I woke up at 7, and the stream starts at 8, and it was about 10 minutes to 8, and I was like, no. Like, I'm just not in the mood to stream. I had streamed all day yesterday, and I was awake for one hour outside of the live stream. Like, I had that one hour of time to myself before going to bed. So the last thing I wanted to do when I first woke up was stream. So at eight o'clock I went back to sleep and then I woke up at 9.30. So got a little extra sleep last night, not too bad. And today is hopefully my last packaging day. It should work out if I maintain my pace from yesterday. I will be starting a little bit later though. I still need to run to Canada Post and Chit Chats with orders. So that'll take a while. Like running to chit chats and back takes me a full hour. So that's gonna cut into the day a little bit, but I'm just gonna try to go fast. Oh, I actually haven't, I haven't disabled the store yet. Well, I don't disable it outright because I like people being able to still access it and stuff. This is a weird angle. Um, <laughs> I pretty much mark all the inventory to zero. That way people can still see the listings. They can see the FAQ page and whatever. I meant to do that last night, but I did not. We have one, two, three, four, five, six. Six prints are still in stock. So I'm just gonna select them all and mark them to zero. So there's been an extra development regarding the Disney doll situation. So I got sent an extra Elsa doll and an extra Olaf key. And this morning I got an email from UPS saying that I have a a delivery scheduled for tomorrow and that the delivery is from shop disney so it appears as though there's another package coming i wondered i wondered because i was like okay hey, they sent me an extra elsa and an extra olaf key but you could only get the olaf key if you bought anna and elsa so where's the other anna you know that's what i was wondering so is this anna is anna coming too <laughs> that's part of the reason why i was also holding off on the, a giveaway i was like well what if what if it comes Plus, I'm still considering just giving it to my nieces, give them the dolls, and their parents can decide if they're allowed to play with it or if they have to keep it as a collectible, whatever. I can let them decide. I'm leaning more towards that again now. I'm, I've been flip-flopping on it, but here's where it gets confusing. So when the first shipments arrived, it was weird because I had to pay customs, of course, because it's coming from the US, and they scanned just the Elsa doll first, and I had to pay $35 customs on that. So it was $30 for the doll, and then $5 fee was for paying at the door, because they charge you a bit extra if you don't pay in advance. And then they scanned the big box that had two dolls in it, and it showed it as already being paid, because the labels for both packages were the same. Because you'd think if it was $30 for the small one, it'd be like $60 for the big box, right? And this order that's supposed to come tomorrow, it has customs due of $60. And then if I wait to pay at the door, it'll be 65. And so I'm like, wait, is there one doll coming or is there two? I'm just, I don't even, I don't even know what's going on. I could also decline the package if I don't want to pay the customs, I could just decline at the door, but I kind of want to take it. I want to accept it. I want to see what's going on. <laughs> the plot thickens. What if it's an Anna and an Elsa and an Olaf key? I'd be shook. I'd be shook. <laughs> so we just play the waiting game now. Will it actually come tomorrow? Who knows? Sometimes they get delayed a day or two, but we'll see. We'll see. Oh, and not a big surprise, but the Calgary Expo is officially postponed. <laughs> they are still aiming to have it later this year. They are hoping in the summer. So I don't know if I'll be able to go or not. It depends on the date. So it's still like a wait and see situation as to whether or not I'll go. Cause I had already decided I'm not going if they're not postponing it, but they're postponing. So you will see. Oh. Oh. Hey, <laughs> Kiki just stole one midnight dugout. <laughs> Christian, would you like some meat, cheese, and crackers? Yeah. With pickles? Yeah. It's wrapped in paper to look all artisanal, and then it's just wrapped in plastic. <laughs> like, why?
So we've eaten our meat, cheese, and crackers. And while I was sitting at the table, I glanced over at the Elsa doll that's sitting there. And I noticed that on her box, it says she's 2.2 kilograms. So I thought, well, will it tell me the weight of the incoming package? And it does. It says five pounds. So it's got to be just the one doll, which which is good. I don't, I don't need more. So yeah, hopefully that's Anna. And then I'll have a pair. And then I can do whatever I do with them unless somehow the label's wrong and therefore the information on the shipment is wrong oh no the box the olaf key came in says six pounds that's not right so this is the big box that both dolls came in and the label says five pounds which is a lie but that's what it says so I guess it could be another big box, but it's most likely just the, the Anna doll. Okay, I gotta count up the US orders to make sure they match the total number of orders I'm supposed to have, and then I can go. I already counted the bottom layer of all the packages just because I knew once I stacked more on top, it would be a pain in the butt to count the bottom row. So it says stuff like bottom 72, and then I have to count the ones that are on the top and add that together. So. These are both for chit chats. And these two are for Canada Post. Oh, she's looking at me. She was watching the TV screen. She never watches the TV. But she was watching the Animal Crossing fishing. Ma'am? She never looks at the TV. Anyway, yeah, I just had to run out and update Christian on the box findings. So that's when I saw Kiki sitting there. <laughs> Okay, so bottom of that box has 72. This one has 150. I thought there was another US box. Oh, it's the one that's up there. <laughs> okay, there's more. I was gonna say, wasn't there one that has 77 on the bottom? Okay. So between those three boxes, there are 504 orders, which is exactly what I was supposed to count to. So perfect. I'll bring those to chit chats first and I'll come back and drop off the rest at Canada Post. The other ones don't need to be counted because there's no batch label. But yeah, that's a lot of orders sitting here. They really stack up when it's the weekend. <laughs> okay, everything is prepped and good to go for another day of packaging. There are 283 orders. So considering I did 304 yesterday, it should hopefully be doable. I am starting a little later today though, so we'll see. I just might mean I have to go later. I, I kind of want to just stay up until like get them done. <laughs> Got this box all taped up and these two here. I'm ready to begin. The trouble is that the body is almost certainly still infectious. You didn't touch him at all, did you Ian? I glanced at Ian who shook his head looking sober. No idea. Not after he fell sick. <laughs> <gasps> you little You're sneak! I don't know why I thought that was an empty box. Yeah. You little goober. So I've only gotten this far into them, but it's already time for a quick break because a package arrived. Two packages. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <gasps> Look at all these. I ordered a thousand of each design. Oh. Nail cats in here. I have to put them on paper to see what they truly look like because washi tape is a little bit see-through and so you know you can see the designs through it. You, you you find out what it truly looks like when you roll it onto paper. Oh my god. <laughs> Making new products is like it gives such a high. I just it's addicting. Look, look, 
Look. Oh, those are cute. Oh my God. Christian, come look at these. Those are my washer tips. Nice suit. Now, where do I put these? I mean, they're gonna stay here for now. I'll be done with the warehouse tonight, so then I can go in there. It's so exciting! <sighs> Making really good progress. It's, of course, it's 7.57. The number that plagues my life. Um, <laughs> I'm making good progress. Christian made some supper though, so I'm gonna take a break and go eat that. Okay, I forgot to vlog it. It was grilled cheese and tomato soup. <laughs> I need to get back to this so I can finish it up. It's 8.49, so yeah, gotta keep going. Cause you know, I could start Animal Crafting tonight. <laughs> Honestly, probably not. <laughs> yeah, I've been going to bed around like 10.30, 10.45. I don't always go to like fall asleep right away, but you know, I'll start getting ready for bed at that time. And so, that's not too far away, because it's almost 9 o'clock, and I'm not sure how many I have left. I would, if I had to guess, I would say 50. I mean, there's one way to do it. I can go to Chit Chats and import orders and see how many it shows that I have. Although, it will not import the next 10 or so that I have open right now, but we can just add that on. 90? Not. That's not right. Okay, no, that's definitely, oh, because I have to start a new import. <laughs> okay, start new import. 25, <gasps> plus like the 10 I have open now. I probably have like 35 left. <gasps> Come on, Bales. Come on, you can do it. Seriously though, thank you guys again for another successful store launch. I always wonder like, are people gonna get sick of these eventually? Like, are the sales gonna trail off? <laughs> It's just wild, especially since, you know, this is all my own original stuff, like, none of it's fan art, people are buying it. Like, like you know, you expect fan art to sell well because people are familiar with the subject matter, you know, but when it's your own stuff, it's different. It's like the hugest of compliments when people want to buy it and stuff, so thank you. <laughs> Plus, like, the store stuff just helps me out so much financially. It's made me feel so much more free, like... I'm not stressing all the time about how well my YouTube videos are doing. Like, it doesn't matter anymore how well they do because, like, before it was, it was like, oh, if, if a bunch of videos do poorly, you know, that's going to affect my bottom line. Now it's like, who cares? <laughs> I can just chill and have a good time with it, you know? It's completely changed how I feel about everything I do online. I kind of want to make a whole video about it, to be honest, like, explaining more things and, I don't know. <laughs> it just, it takes a lot of the stress off everything, I guess, you know? Because there's a shift when you start doing your hobby as a job, there's that pressure to, like, make enough money doing it, and so, you know, with YouTube, it's like, yeah, okay, okay, you're having fun with it, but you're also thinking, okay, it, Am I pleasing the algorithm? Am I am I getting enough views? Am I uploading often enough that my videos will continue to get pushed and blah, 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 like... There's this whole layer of stress you don't need. <laughs> it's like I'm back in the older YouTube days where my ability to pay rent is not based on how well my YouTube videos do. That's why I plan on doing more time-consuming videos going forward. Ooh, I ripped that across the barcode. I'm gonna reprint that. Hair is not bad unless it's across the barcode. Anyway, I think you get my point about the whole thing. <laughs> so thank you guys for all the love in the store. <laughs> I'm so close to the end now, but I ran out of ducky stickers and I ran out of business cards, like the thank you cards. I will have two left, but I must have ordered 1,500 because my total number of orders is 1,529. So. That would explain why I'm gonna be approximately 29 short. <laughs> I'm just wondering for the stickers if it's worth busting out the Cricut or if I should just use my buttonhole punch. So these are way too big, like the hole punch is too big. 
I know not everyone is going to put them on their pop socket. Not everyone even has a pop socket. But, you know, if someone was anticipating doing that because I advertised that, then I wouldn't want to let them down. So I'm doing it with the Cricut. I'm going to do three sheets, so I don't want to cut them out by hand. Alexa, why is your light red? Oh, yeah, I probably pushed something. Yeah. Anywho, so yeah, gonna gonna do this. Just a slight delay, slight delay. Uh, of course it's feeding Cricket. Stop, stop. Now the ink is running out. I don't have time for this. bring rats and frogs into the house. I don't kill them. I don't even maim them. I just turn them loose. Also, I bite my human sister's feet while she is sleeping. And I'm done! Mm. 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 It is 9.50. There's time for a little bit of Animal Crossing. Just a little bit. This I can clean up tomorrow because I'm out of here. I'm out of here! Here are the packages from today. <laughs> ah, cute. <laughs> Actually, I'm going to flip it back. I know they make it so you can flip them over, but I just I just want the OG on the cover. I like the bright colors. Oh, baby. I'm not going to soft reset for fruit or airport color, but I will be soft resetting for the layout of my land. I want one with a heart-shaped pond. So it's my second try, and there is one with a heart, but it's way on the edge. I don't like that. I'm gonna try again. Locust Gerard's description of Christine paints a picture of delinquency, compulsive behavior, and aggression. And attempted baby nap or an extortion to that list, and it's almost lost the best thing in my life because I was too afraid to be honest with her. Well, I got a penis shaped like, not heart shaped. Are you saying I should have Kiki in my town? This one looks interesting. It has an island in it. An island in the island. This one's a double wishbone. Okay, we got one with a heart. We got this one. Do I like that? I mean, I guess so. That's a lot of water. I kind of like ones that are split into thirds like this. It's kind of clean looking. This one's like, what? But it's got the heart. With me. I can't get pink hair yet. Uh, I just so picked white for now. She found Christine. Our suspect. I'm so excited. Is that Kiki in the background? I saw Kiki. Look, you can't just leave. What happened? I'm a cherry island. Your husband did this? <laughs> orange though? Oh, hell no. I wanted any color other than orange. Whatever. It's fine. There's me. For now. It's all my fault. Okay. It is 12.30 almost. I am falling asleep. I gotta go to bed. But I had fun with the bit of Animal Crossing I got to play. Woohoo! Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm gonna sit for a bit. Ah! I just knocked over a little container of mini eggs. Oh, they're probably everywhere.